Chicken connoisseur. Man, like, lied you in the building. What are you saying, bro? Yeah, I'm cool, man. I don't know, man. Don't. <laughs> well, what's, what's the thing with the age, bro? Like, why, why don't you want to reveal your age? Well, for the people who know, they know. If you don't know. I know. And that's that. We have mutual friends. Fair enough. We have mutual bread your hands. All right, then. But what, like, what is, what's the idea behind that? Like, what's the idea behind concealing the age? Ultimately, it's not necessarily concealing. It's just like someone asked me, like, "Oh, what's your address?" or "What's your date?" It's bit, a bit different. It, it's true, isn't it? It is different. a bit different. Like, man, asked me for yo, you what's your address? I'm like, what? Why would you? Why would my address for? Like, man says, "How old are you?" I'm gonna say, "I'm gonna tell him how old I am." Yeah, I, I don't know. I just don't feel people really need to know if they want to talk about it and it's a big talking point. Then I don't mind. Letting how them old talk. are you? Don't worry. Come on, Elijah, man, just <laughs> put it out there, bro. Let them know. Well, how do how old do I look? You look about 15. All right, then I'll give it that. You're not 15. <laughs> I was at one stage. You were, Obviously, you yeah. was at one stage, but you're not now. Now, bro, I heard you're also into your crepes. Yeah, yeah, very much so. Yeah. What's your favourite pair of trainers? Uh, the ones I'm wearing now. What you got on? Uh, oh, I'll pull it up. The Air Max 90, Atmos Tiger Camo. Nice. Yeah. Nice, it's nice. Like reflective. Yeah, um, yeah. The yeah. glow in the dark speckles Yeah, yeah. As nice well. drop, man. Nice camo. Nice drop. How many pairs of trainers you got? I don't have that much. It's like no. forty or so. Yeah. Yeah. Sick. What's your favorite? What's your favorite all-time pair? Um, it is this one. Yeah. Yeah. Like, what's your favorite model? Nineties, then. I think so. Yeah. 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 My thing. What that? <laughs> now, bro. Obviously, you are the chicken connoisseur. Yeah. Like, I believe you. I yeah. believe that you're the guy. Like the way you're describing what's going on with the chicken, I'm like, yeah, I, mm. I, I like this. It's good. Yeah. But obviously, it's Christmas now. Mm-hmm. So. When it comes to Christmas, it's not about chicken. It's about really? turkey, bro. I've heard that. It's about turkey, bro. Mm. The turkey's important. Now, I thought, you know what? I need to see how on point you are. Wait. Three sandwiches, all from different places. Um, and the chicken connoisseur right now. Oh, it took the color. Look at that. Ooh. The gloves come off, you know, bro. <laughs> Man took off the glove. Glove just slid off. My thing. Put it. Right, so you, he's inspecting the sandwiches. So tell us, tell us what you're looking for there. Um, ultimately, I'm just looking to see what the ratio is right now. Mm-hmm. What the ratio is looking like? Um, they're a bit problematic in certain areas, I must say. Yeah, yeah. Well, what's what's the problems? Well, okay, this one here doesn't have enough sauce. I can see there's almost nothing in there. If mm. There is any at all? No. Like there's a lot of stuff in. So that one's going to be pretty dry. Mm. This one has a good bit of cranberry. We've got bacon as well. Mm. So that should be decent. This one, it's, it's looking a bit dead. Like it's just cranberry and turkey. Like there's not much else. Mm. So that one's probably, that's probably the deadest. That's the driest, and this is the best. All right, let, let's let's go for the taste test yeah. now. All right, just take one bite of each sandwich. He's tucking into sandwich number one. How's that? What's what's that saying? It's all right. Yeah. Mm. Like, is it dry or? No, it's quite all right because they do have a decent bit of cranberry. Because mm. there isn't too many other fillings in there as mm. well. Yeah. What's, what's, the, what's the ratio like though with the stuffing and, and the turkey? I think that's important. Mm. Stuffing is. I'm. Um, I didn't realize there was any in there, but there's a little bit, not mm. much. Yeah, there's like two bits of turkey. Even the way they arranged it in here, the assembly isn't really on point. Mm. So, if I was going to eat this as a whole sandwich, I'd be very disappointed. All right, let's score. Let's score that one out of five. Out of five, this gets like three. Three. Yeah. Decent. Yeah. Decent. It gets by. So that is sandwich number one. It's got a three star rating so far. And I just tuck into sandwich number two. What's that one saying? This one's the best. That's the so far. That's the best one. Yeah. Well, what what do you like about that one? This one has bacon in it as well. Mm. Also fills it up a lot more. You got a lot more stuff in. You have a lot more turkey in there mm. all around. And taking that into account, they had enough cranberry sauce, so it isn't actually that dry. Okay. So that was sandwich number two. I'll get to the drink. Um, what 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 you rating that one, bro? That one. For a turkey sandwich, it's getting 4.5. 4.5? 4.5? Wow! It's doing bits. That's a big score, bro. It is. And you'll understand when you have some. Yeah. Trust me. Sandwich number three just took a big bite of that one. 
What we say on Elijah? Well, so from the beginning, it's dry. Mm. So, I, have to get I can hear it's dry. You it, see? it sounds dry you in your mouth. Exactly. It's not like you're eating cardboard there, bro. It's not far off. Mm. So it takes a lot more effort to get it down. Mm. It's got lettuce and stuff in it. There's a lot of filling. The filling's fine, but it's just lacking a cranberry sauce. If that was on point, then this one could have took it. Yeah. What, yeah. what, what score are you giving that one? It's a bit of a difficult one because mm. this one had like nothing in there, but... Yeah. The sandwich number one had right. nothing. Yeah, but this one, it has a lot more in there. It's just lacking a cranberry sauce. So it depends. If you have your own sauce, then, you know, this, this could be a decent four. But right now, it's looking like 3.7. 3.7, I mean, it's yeah. not bad. It's, it's not bad. still. It's not bad. So can we reveal where the sandwiches were from, please? Yeah. So so we know. So sandwich number one, where was that from? Tesco. Tesco. So sandwich number one, Tesco sandwich. Only got a, f was it a free, weren't it? A yeah. free for sandwich number one. Tes sandwich number two. Co-op. Co-op sandwich, done No, They got the big four. And Saints. Sainsbury's was number three, so there you go. If you want that chicken sandwich, that, 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 that turkey sandwich, the festive sandwich, it's all about co-op. Matting, bro. Oh. Good work, bro. Oh, gosh. Bro, it's been an absolute pleasure, man. Definitely. You're bro. a G, bro. Keep yeah. doing your thing. Safe. And you're always welcome up here. But next time, bring some chicken. No, I thought you were trying to bring some chicken. I can't lie. Listen, they said I'm not allowed food in here, so... Nah, but I, this is my show. I'm allowed to do anything here. Right, fair like, enough. It's different rules for me here, isn't it? All right. Like, when... ne next time, bring some chicken, though. No? Yeah, yeah. When you're ready, you can come my ends and we can link somewhere uh, as well. Follow me, man. I'm ready for that. You, I know you know the chicken spots. Yeah. I've got one, two, six bots as well, you know? All right, cool. Yeah? Yeah, bring me. All right, done, no. Calm.